everyone, how are you today? I hope all of you are fine. Today in science lesson, we are going to learn about materials around us. Alright. Did you know that the things around us are made of materials? But where did the materials come from? So, to answer this question, let's relearn together. Materials can be natural and also can be man-made. We can get natural materials from animals or plants and we can also get materials from the ground. How about man-made? Man-made materials cannot be found in the nature. They are made by people. Alright. Now, let's take a look at the example of natural materials. First, the example of natural materials from animals. First, wool. We can get wool from sheep. And we use wool to make sweater. Next, leather. We can get leather from cow or crocodile. And we use leather to make bag or belt. Next, silk. We can get silk from silkworm. We use silk to make dress or tie. Next, the example of natural materials from plants. First, cotton. We get cotton from cotton plant. We use cotton to make t-shirt. Next, wood. We can get wood from trees. We use wood to make door or chair. Next, rubber. We can get rubber from rubber trees. We use rubber to make balloon or eraser. Next, the example of natural materials from the ground. First, stone. We can get stone and we use stone to make statue. Second, Clay. We use clay to make bricks. And next, metal. We use metal to make gold ring. Okay, now the example of man made materials. First, plastic, such as this bag, plastic bag, and this cup and straw. How about glass? We use glass to make drinking glass and magnifying glass. Okay, next. The materials we use every day are either made of metals or non-metals. Okay, let's take a look. Some common non-metals are wood, glass, plastic, rubber, clay, fabric, and leather. Some common metals are gold, silver, iron, and copper. By the way, are you still remember the properties of metals? Very good! The properties of metals are shiny, strong, and hard. And also, we can short objects according to their properties or according to the materials they are made of. Let's look at these objects. Can you differentiate? which object 
made of metals with objects made of non-metals. 1. Chair 2. Spoon 3. Trolley Which one? Very good! The object made of metal is spoon. The rest is made of non-metals. This chair is made of wood. And this balloon is made of rubber. Okay everyone, that's all for today. I hope all of you understand about our lesson today. Thank you for your attention. See you next time. Bye-bye.